welcome to my channel, New Leaf Podcast. I thought it would be fun to do a couple of vlogs for the month of September. Granted, it's still August right now, but I kind of feel that vlogs need to have one month as a, as a theme so you can have uh, Vlogmas in the run-up to Christmas, which is in December, and you have Vlogist uh, and as in August, but, you know, as it's kind of, you know, it's almost the end of August, and I thought, hmm, I would have actually have really liked to do that, so I thought, why not just do some vlogs in September? So, uh, because, um, September, I don't know, I think it's gonna be a really fun month, um, because my business anniversary is coming up, um, not actually, my business anniversary is in October, but my full-time designing career started September 20th last year. So, um, yeah, so September is going to be a month of celebration for me. Um, and I am publishing a new pattern on September 1st. So I just thought I would take you through, you know, everyday stuff as I did for Vlogmas, but now in not so wintry atmosphere. And um, I thought it would be fun. So... Yeah, join me if you want. <laughs> Maybe this will turn into a podcast, I don't know. But the pattern that I am publishing on September 1st is the Rainbow Sea Waves Blanket. Ta-da! Which has rainbow waves. And I really love it. <laughs> um, so that's going to be published September 1st on Tuesday. This vlog will probably go out on the same day. And it's going to be a free pattern on my blog, New Leaf Designs. And I'm also going to make a paid PDF version, as I try to do with all of my free patterns, just because my patterns on my blog are not easy to print. And I understand that people want to do that, but, you know, making a PDF costs way more time. So... So I always um, make a paid PDF version, and also it's a nice for uh, it's a nice way to support me. Uh, lots of people um, just buy the paid PDF version of my free patterns, and that is really, really very much appreciated. So, yes, thank you all very much. Um, yes, so today is Saturday, but I think I'm going to be doing some work anyway. I am going to be writing down the color order list for the pattern and some other bits and pieces. So I have a new sock design in progress and I started this sock three days ago and um, I wasn't sure about the color because it's very subtle but then I got in a lighter patch with the um, variegated yarn so this is one solid yarn and one variegated yarn and here it's very uh similar the colors but here they get a little bit more contrasting so i'm really happy with that I'm making the second one right now and it's up for testing in my tester group on facebook um and i'm not sure yet if this is going to be a singular pattern uh, because i've been wanting to do an ebook for ages, so I thought to do a little sock collection thing. I thought it would be fun. Um, so yesterday I cast on for the second sock um, pattern, and I'm not liking the combination at all. It just um, the yarns have enough contrast in them. I mean, that's pretty obvious that they have enough contrast, but I think it has to do with the pattern, the stitch pattern, because um, 
there the lines are too thin so it's still not easy to see the pattern with this one I have more solid lines than with this yeah so it's back to the drawing board so I'm not sure if I um, will keep the yarn colors or if I'll just change the color work pattern because I don't really like these two together anymore <laughs> um, yes so back to the drawing board for that Thank you. 